Do not undertake the exercises illustrated in this video without prior medical advice. Hello everybody and thank you for joining us today at the VON class. Today you'll be requiring a good sturdy chair that you can use for your balance and we're going to sit down today and do some exercises together. Excellent. Here we go. We're going to begin with some of our marching. So we're sitting up nice and tall. Our arms are moving. We're just going to get warmed up here. Perfect. job. Now let's begin with some of our heel digs. We're just going to dig our heels. Remember to go at your own pace. If at any time you're feeling tired, oh this is Sam, welcome Sam. Anytime you're feeling tired, just take a break, grab a drink. You can pause the video. I'll still be here when you come back. Great. Now let's take this out to the side. It's a side tap. Good. Good job. Let's try two more on each side. Perfect. Now we're going to start some knee raises here. Let's bring those knees up. Good. Listen to your body here. Only do what's comfortable. If at any time you're feeling discomfort, just discontinue the movement. Now we're going to swing our arms and get our shoulders working. Good job. Now let's try some running. Feet are moving, our arms are moving, we're getting warmed up. Ooh, that's excellent. Now let's use both arms here. We're just going to reach out and pull back. Out and back. Now we're not leaning forward at all, we're just stretching. Let's do two more reaches. Excellent. Now we're going to bring those knees up again. Nice. And this time let's add some arm movement with it. Let's add a punch. So you're going to punch up, punch up. Good. Now I'm using opposite arm and opposite leg here. But do what's comfortable for you. Do two more on each. Perfect. This time, what we're going to do is we're going to bring our arms out to the side. We're going to circle. Good. Now, our circles are below the shoulders. We don't want to go up above our heads like this. Just nice, comfortable, low circles. Let's try that in the other direction. Good. 
two more circles, one more circle. Ooh, good job. Let's go running again. Ooh, it feels so good. Okay, using both arms again, let's reach out, pull back, reach and back. try two more times. Excellent. We're going to raise those knees one more time. Up. Good. And this time we're going to double lift. So it's going to be two raises on each side. Excellent. Let's try that one more time on each leg. Nice, and let's swing those arms again. Excellent job. And we're going to do running one more time. Good. Let's try going just a little bit faster. All right. And both arms reach and back. Good. This time what we're going to do is we're going to hold it out here. We're just going to alternate our Pulse. Alternate your pulse. Good. Excellent. Let's keep going. Two more on each side. Perfect. All right, now just take it to your shoulders for a moment. We're just going to shrug our shoulders up and down. Let's do it again. Get a nice stretch and down. And good. We'll go two more shrugs. One more. Perfect. Now we're just going to roll our shoulders back. Nice and big. Perfect. Let's place our hand on the shoulder. We're going to circle our elbow. Excellent. Let's try the same thing on the other side. Circle that elbow forward. Good. And release it. Good job. You should be good and warm now. We're going to start with opposite shoulder touches. Shoulder touches. We're still sitting up nice and tall. Both of our feet are flat on the ground. One more each. Perfect. All right, now we're just going to take it to the leg. Just a little kick out to the front. Good. Now we're going to be ready now for our very first set of stand up sit downs. Now you can do this in a few different variations. You can place your hands on top of your legs to give you a support when you push yourself up. You can place your arms to the side for a little extra challenge or 
you can cross your arms for extra, extra challenge. I'm gonna start here and push myself up and gently sit myself back down. Again, good. Notice we're not dropping in the chair. We're standing up and slowly sitting down. more. And one more time. Perfect. Now let's place our hand here on the shoulder and we're just going to reach out and in and out. Good. Now let's reach up a little higher. Stretch it up. two more. Perfect. Now let's try that on the other side. Out. Good. Now we're going to reach up just a little higher. Reach up. two more on this side. One and two. Excellent. Let's try some bicep curls here. We're going to curl up. Good. Notice my elbows are close to the body. Elbows are not moving. It's just the forearm. Let's do two more. Perfect. We're going to go into some punching and punch. Good. So your punches are just reaches. Straight out, about shoulder height if you can. We're not leaning forward. Good. Excellent job. Two more in each. Well done. Now we're going to stretch those legs again. Kick those legs out. Good. Excellent. One more time on each. Perfect. We're ready for another set of our stand-up sit-downs. This time I'm going to place my arms to the sides. Do what's comfortable for you. Here we go. Up and slowly back down. We're not going to drop in our chair. We're going to control the movement. And again. Excellent. Let's do a couple more. One more time. Perfect job. Excellent. Now we're going to touch those shoulders again. We're still sitting up nice and tall. Good. This time we're going to add our ears. So we're going to do a shoulder, a shoulder, an ear, an ear. Shoulders, ears. Shoulders, ears. Good. Let's try that two more times. Perfect. All right.
right now. Let's do some bicep curls. Bring it up and down. And this time, let's add a reach. Here we go. We're going to curl up, push out, back, down again. Curl out, back, down. Up, out, back. Good. One more. Out, down. Okay, now this time, let's reach up. Stretch out front, up top, out, good, couple more, one more of each, excellent job, well done. Now we're going to place that hand here on the shoulder again, this time we're going out to the sides. Good. Good. We're going to reach up again. Up. Two more times. And changing arms. It's out. In and out. Good. Reach higher. Good, one more time. Perfect, and we're going into our punches. Here we go, punch. Good job. Now let's punch just a little bit higher. So you should be able to see your hand in front of your face. Good. Not much higher than that. Perfect. For four, three, two, last one. And let's stretch those legs again. Excellent. All right, we're ready for our final set of stand up sit downs. This time, I'm going to cross my arms. Oopsie. Crossing my arms. We're going to stand up and down. Let's do it again. We're standing up. Now don't forget to breathe here guys. We tend to hold our breath when it gets difficult. Good. And again. Up. Good. One more time. Perfect. Let's work on that bicep again. Curl. Down. Curl. Good. Let's add those reaches. Let's reach out front and push. Back, down. Again, out. And down. Perfect. Now this time, we're going to reach up. Let's stretch. Listen to your body here. If at any time discomfort comes, you just discontinue. Two more. Out. And up. One more. Out. And up. Good. All right. Woo. Shake that off a little bit. And we're going to do that round one more time. We're touching our shoulders. Good. Perfect. Now this time, let's keep going with the shoulders and let's add some heel digs. Digging our heels and touching our shoulders. Perfect. 
We're going to do two more of each. Excellent. All right, now we're going to work on this again. Out, let's alternate sides and up top. Good. Let's do two more of each. Perfect. Now we're going to change sides. Take it out and up. Good. One more of each. Excellent. Now we're going to work on that bicep again. Curl up. Good. Let's add those. Reach out front. Here it comes. And stretch down. Out front. Reaching up. And out. And down. Again. Front. Up. Out, down, again, out front, up top, out, down, one more of everything, up, good, last one in, good, let's do some punches. Good job. Well done, everybody. Woo, just give that a light shake all over. And let's take it down to our feet here. We're just going to raise up our toes. Perfect. Let's try going just a little bit faster. Switch it to our heels. Good. Now let's just move our right foot like a Charleston move. Heel and toe just on the right side. Good. Now you can go at your own pace here. You can go slow if you want to go a little bit faster. You can do that too. Perfect. Now let's try the same thing on the other side. Good job. One more time. Excellent. Bring it up to your hands now. Let's circle our hands around. We're just going to loosen up that wrist area. And we're going to go the other way. Good. Now reaching across. Just a quick stretch in our shoulders. Excellent. And we're changing sides. Super. Excellent. Now what we're going to do is a sprint crawl. So this is a fairly big range of motion. Only do what's comfortable. Good. Always feels so good. Perfect. Now we're going to go back down to our legs and we're going to do a walking motion. So we're just going to bring our feet front opposites, alternating front and back. 
And I like to add in my arm for a little arm swing. And I like to do an opposite arm and an opposite leg. This is optional. Do what's comfortable for you. Perfect. Good job. Now let's bring our arms up into a goal post position and bring our elbows close together. Remember, only bring them as close as what's comfortable for you and try to remember to breathe. You want to exhale right here. Inhale and exhale. Good. Let's do two more times. Perfect. Shake that off a little and we're going to go right into a breast stroke. Good, two more. Excellent, all right. Just give that a little shake all over. Well done, everybody. Grab a drink if you need one, this is a good time. And we're gonna stand up now behind our chairs and we're gonna work some of our balance exercise. I think Zoe has come to help us. All right. Good. Making sure that you have a good sturdy balance chair that you can hang on to. And we're going to begin with our up on our toes, stretching the back of our legs. We're just going to go right up on our toes and back down again. I will turn my chair so you can see what I'm doing. We're going up and down. Let's try again up. And down. This is Zoe. And down. Let's do two more like that. And one more. Excellent. All right. Now let's go with that right leg. And we're going to do a side leg extension. So we're going to take it out and back. Out to the side and back. Good. You'll notice I have a slight pause at the very top of my movement. Good. I'm working my opposite leg, making sure that I'm feeling stable in my balance. Good. One more time. Excellent. And just lightly march that off. Let's change sides. Same thing, out. Excellent. Couple more times. Last one. Perfect. And again, just slightly march that off. We're going to go to the right side again. This time, we're going to do a back leg extension. We're going to take it behind us and neutral. Still standing up nice and tall. And back. And back. Good. A couple more times. Perfect, and just gently march that off. Let's do the same on the other side. Take it behind you, neutral. Excellent, let's do two more times. Good, and again.
again, just gently march that off. Perfect. All right. This time what we're going to do is what we call a tandem stance. So we're going to place the right foot in front of the left foot. So your heels and toes are touching. Your chair is in front of you for balance. And let's start by looking to our left side. We're going to hold this position for five, four, three, two, one. Let's look to the left. For five, four, three, two, one. And we're releasing. Let's change sides. Same thing. Bringing your left foot in front. Heels and toes are touching. And we're going to look to the right. For five, four, three, two, one. We're looking to our left. For five, four, three, two, one. And release. Good job. All right. We're going to work on that bicycle movement. Starting with your right leg, let's raise it up and we're going to pedal. Good. Hanging on to your chair for balance. Excellent. Two more pedals. One more. Well done. Gently march that off and let's go to the other side and we're pedaling. Good. You might notice your supporting leg is working a little bit here. One more circle. Perfect. And just shake that off. Well done. We're going to do one more balance exercise. We're just going to stand on our one leg and hold this position for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, Four, three, two, one, and switch. For ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Ooh, and shake it off. Well done, everybody. Grab yourself another drink. Let's have a seat. We're going to do a little bit of a cool down here, so some stretches. Let's start off with some deep breathing. Here we go. Let's expand those lungs. Inhale. And exhale. Again, inhale. And out. Good. Again, in. And out. Just going to place our chin right down to our chest. Let's continue deep breathing while we're stretching. Perfect. Now let's release that and gently resting our ear towards the shoulder. Keep breathing here. Good. Get a good stretch. It's so important to stretch after any exercise. That will help prevent any muscle cramping or tightening.
Cooper. And we're going to change sides. Excellent work. Let's release. Perfect. Now we're going to place our hand on the shoulder and stretch out that tricep. Know your own limits here. Listen to your body. So good. And releasing. Let's try the same on the other side. Good. Only stretch it as far as what's comfortable for you. Stretching does not hurt. It just feels nice. And we're releasing. Let's take that right arm, reach across, stretching the shoulder. Perfect. And we're going to change sides, reach across. And let's release. Well done. Now we're going to stretch out our legs. That was Zoe again. Placing our leg out. Good. Our toes are pointed up. Our hands are on the opposite leg. Let's place our hands well behind our knees. We don't want to apply any pressure on the knee area. Super. Let's point those toes down. Good work. And we are releasing. Let's try that on the other side. Again, we're placing our hands on the opposite side, well behind our knees. Our toes are pointed upwards. So good. Let's point the toes downward. Good. And we are releasing. Good job. We're just going to do a couple more stretches standing up behind our chairs. I will turn my chair so that you're able to see what I'm doing. Placing my foot to the back, I'm just gently pushing my hips forward, feeling a stretch in the quadricep. That's the front part of your leg. Now my knee is slightly bent here. We always try to keep our joints soft. You don't want to lock your joints at any time.
So good. And we're going to do the same on the other side. Just gently pushing my hips forward. Excellent. Let's release that. That right leg this time is going to go back. So the heel of that back foot is flat. Your front knee is bent. Good. Remember, we're just stretching. If you have any discomfort or pain, just loosen it up a little bit. Let's try that on the other side. Good. Super. Now we're going to release. Let's finish up here with our ankle rotation. We're going to circle that foot around and let's be mindful of our circles. They're big, they're round, and it is only the foot that's turning. Nothing else. And the other way. Good. And changing sides. And the other way. Good job. And just give that a light shake all over. Well done, everybody. I appreciate you all joining us today. Hope to see you next time.